Now the topic before us is overcoming nervousness and anxiety during presentation. Many people experience nervousness and anxiety when they are giving presentation. Now we will discuss some of the tips to overcome the nervousness and anxiety when we are giving the presentation. First point is prepare thoroughly. We should practice our presentation several times beforehand and we should make sure that we know our material well. Next point is visualize success. We should imagine that we are giving a successful presentation and the audience is very happy with our presentation and the audience is giving a very positive feedback to our presentation. If we have such type of imagination or visualization in our mind, we will feel more confident and calm and we will be in a position to give a better presentation. Next point is focus on your message and not on your nervousness. While giving the presentation, we should keep in mind the purpose of the presentation. Next point is use relaxation techniques. Before giving the presentation, we should practice deep breathing, meditation or other relaxation techniques to help calm our nerves. Next point is use positive self-talk. If we think that I cannot do something, I will not be in a position to perform better or give proper presentation, we are likely to fail while delivering the presentation and the it will prove to be total disastrous as a presenter. So, we should use positive affirmation and self talk It will help in building our confidence and reduce our anxiety. We should tell ourselves that we are well prepared. We can do something. We can give the presentation in a very better manner. And then you will be in a position to give a successful presentation. Next point is embrace imperfection. Remember that it is okay to make mistakes. Only by making mistakes we can at the end we can give a better presentation. By making practice time and again we will learn what where we have done something imperfect and we can make the changes accordingly and one day we will become a successful presenter. So do not fear of failure. You should think that you can give a presentation properly and only then you can give your presentation in a very confident manner. Now we will like to conclude this course with the saying that we should be very confident while delivering a presentation. While giving the presentation, we can ask questions from the audience to keep them engaged. We can also seek feedback from them. We should use visual aids which are relevant and which are proper as per the topic which on which we are giving the presentation. We should also keep in mind that the non-verbal communication also plays an important role in presentation. So, we should use our body language properly in our presentation. We should not use complex language in case of presentation and we should use simple language as far as possible so that the audience is 
in a position to understand what you are saying to them and we should vary our tone as per the situation and we should always think positive that we can deliver a presentation properly. Thanks for watching. If you like our course, please spare some time to give a star rating to our course.